Good morning, everybody. Today is November 6th. It is 51 degrees. Let me see what the temperature, what the time is. It is exactly, ooh, it's 9-11. I have to change the time, but it's 9-11 a.m. because the time has changed. Yay. I like that. I like it. It gets dark earlier. That's still, that's the only drawback of time change is it gets dark earlier but you know what it, it is what it is right um i um uh, we're gonna go for it we're gonna attempt a walk at the park hercules has not been very cooperative in that direction but yeah um yeah, he's not been very cooperative in the walking direction at the park. So it's just, you know, all of if 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 he's gonna do it or if he's not. I'm hoping he agrees to, you know, just this walk. Because, you know, I enjoy it. I mean I could come back, but I don't know. I probably would, because I need the walk. Well, Officially seen, I broke at 40. Yay! With my weight loss. I mean, I... Am I proud of it? Yeah. I have, you know, yeah. It, it's not easy. It, it's just absolute. First time ever, my daughter really noted. She says, Mom, you're back to where you when you had the weight loss. Or nothing. Not quite. I said, but I'm getting there. You know, I got some more weight to go, for sure, for sure, for sure, but I'm getting there, you know. Um, I'll probably never get there, but, you know, with the with the, the, the exact weight I was, and I'm okay. You know, 20 more pounds, hey, I hit my goal, but, uh, again, that doesn't stop because I have a whole year to go. I got, like, eight more months to go with this, so. We'll see where that lands me. It, it's, the, of course, like it's, you know, I'm averaging one to three pounds a week. But it doesn't mean they won't stop because I know there is a plateau I'm going to reach. And then you have to really work hard and do a lot of, uh, what's it called, a lot of uh, restriction to, to get there. Somebody sent me a message to talk about intermittent fasting, and I would love to. Let me talk about it, okay, in this video. Intermittent fasting to me is a way to kick, is to put your weight loss in the next level. And you can do it like, you, you don't know, okay, I do 8, 16, I eat 8 hours, I fast 16. Okay. And what that does, it just puts you just like just like what it is doing. You're fasting. If you fast, most likely you lose weight. When you fast, you do lose weight because your body is 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 feeding off of the fat reserves you have. So it's eating up that fat. Okay. Now I do keto or low, I'm gonna say low carb. I do a little carb keto, whatever, okay. And that even puts it into another realm because I am already eating low amounts of like sh no sugars hardly at all. And no breads, no pastas, no, nothing like that. So when you do the intermittent fasting with that, it's, it's like I said, it's a different level. It's like, wow. And I, I'll tell you something, before I did this, I noticed that I wasn't losing weight that fast. I noticed that my weight loss kicked up when I do the intermittent fasting. When I do that and I stick to it, not breaking it, you know, and staying pretty much true to what I'm supposed to do, I usually lose something. But when I... You know, even like I, I go off and I eat some, you know, eat to eat or drink something with 
calories or carbohydrates. I feel like I don't lose as regularly, regularly and as easily as I do when I do the intermittent fasting. I, on intermittent fasting, and I'm going by what I've learned by Dr. Berg. He is like my guru, like almost like, I, I listen to what he says and I try to do it. I'm not perfect by any means, okay? I, I probably do a lot of things that probably wouldn't be recommended because like, okay, I do drink diet soda. Yes, I do. I drink diet soda. I drink it, um, you know, uh, while I'm doing this. I'll drink anything with zero sugar. I, um, coffee, I'll tell you something about coffee, though. I, I sometimes do, but not that often. I, I try to stay away from it until to my time to, to eat is 10 o'clock. Then, you know, but they say you could drink the black coffee with it, and then you could do the, like, with the cream and, or the no sugar added, and I, and I do, you know, I do that. Um, I'm just trying to gather my thoughts. Or you could do bone broth, too. Bone broth will satiate you. Yes, it will. Not only will it do that. You know, it, it, it helps with uh, burning the fat because it's more fat, you know. Um, and it doesn't taste bad. It really doesn't. Uh, but I do give a lot of credit to the, the intermittent fasting. Like, again, I, I do 8-16. Some people do 6 and uh, like tw uh, 18. You know, no. Uh, I, 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 that's just, that, that, that's better than me. I can't do that. Not yet. If I find myself in a position where I'm not losing weight anymore, you know, like a couple weeks, I would up it a little bit. I don't, I've thought about doing fasting. I have a friend who did fasting. She lost a lot of weight too. But I'm not going to do that because I do think I do have some sort of a when I don't eat, let's just say, okay, like today is well it's 918, but it's really 1018. My body knows it's 1018, but my you know. Anyway, when I don't eat, I skip a meal, I always pay for it in the next one. And I eat too much or I kind of overeat more than I normally would. Because for some reason my head is still stuck and stupid. So, I just do what I know how, what I do best, you know. I mean, my, my advice or my thoughts on this, I think intermittent fasting is great. You don't have to do it every day. Some people do it three times a week. Some people do it on the weekend. Some people do it, you know, they do it occasionally. I do it every day. I do it every day. And, oh, lemon water. Lemon water is excellent. It will fill you up. It tastes good. There's no artificial sweeteners in it. And the lemon helps cut your fat. You know, it, it does. It, it really, really does. Um, I, I do enjoy lemon water. I do drink it quite often. I, I have, I always buy bags of lemons. Um, it's just, you know, it, it, it's what gets you to where you need to be and where you want to be. You know, some people this might not work for. Some people it does. And sometimes I think it's mind. You know, like if you believe it's going to work, it's going to work. That's how I, I am with my whatever so-called keto slash uh, low carb. I know it's going to work, so it's working. If I didn't believe it would work, it might not work. I would find reasons for it not to work. You know, it, it, when I first started the, the intermittent fasting, I stopped it. And then I said, no, you know, if I look back, I did lose weight. My ears just popped out, I don't know why, but they did. Um, and um, 
you know, I, 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 uh, and then I tried it again with a different attitude, and it really worked, and, you know, that is what keeps me going, you know, I know how I feel, right now I'm really hungry, I could really use to have some breakfast right now, but, you know, according to the time, I've got to wait, i got to wait 40 minutes, and I'm going for a walk, so by the time I'm done with my walk, I'll be closer to the time where I can have coffee, and that's a good thing, because that fills you up, and, you know, I can start enjoying food, you know, but again, you have to do what's best for you. Some people count calories, not I. Some people count uh, fats, not I. Fats to me are like, I want fats in my diet. Okay, be it, you know, I don't they one day I'll just drop dead of a heart attack. I don't know. I don't feel, I feel very good. I feel healthier than I felt in a long time. So, you know, I, I can't, I can't give you advice, I can just tell you what I think. I think intermittent fasting for me is the way to go. It speeds up, I think it speeds up your metabolism. It helps you get over humps when you can't get, lose those few pounds that you really want to lose. And it's never failed me in since July. Well, no, I didn't start it in July. I started basically, I think, in August. You know, the end of August, I started doing the intermittent fasting. And and that's when I saw my weight loss pick up. You know, it was doing all right in the beginning with a, with a low carb. And I do think a lot of diets anymore are low carb. I mean, you know, I mean, let's just be real. That's where your sugar's at, right? But again, I can't suggest what works for me might not work for you. What works for you might not work for me. I don't use pills of any kind. I don't use any appetite suppressant. I just don't feel the need. I feel like if I did that personally, this is just for personal reasons. When I went off of it, I would go right back. I mean, it's hard enough not to go back to your eating pattern anyway. But to go back to, to have something inhibiting your eating and then you stop it. You're just going to, you're setting yourself up for failure. That's how I look. I, I believe it's best to work on it, to find something that will work for you to the best of its ability and go with that. And um, always it's best to go see a doctor because you might find you might have a thyroid, look towards that. You might find you have a thyroid issue. You might find you have other issues that maybe are, is is you know hint, it, you know not helping you lose weight and sometimes people do and you just don't know getting out back you know poo bag so it's always best to check it's always good to talk to a doctor it's always good to get a, a physical before you start anything I did I, I I didn't get it right before but I did and I and I am going to the doctor and I'm, I'm recording my weight there because I need to keep track of my, you know, my cholesterol levels are going up or down or, you know, I do take medications I'm trying to get off of and I believe I will. And if I don't, then I don't. Okay. 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 questions just you know email me or text me or leave a comment and, and I do answer my comments have a great day stay safe and enjoy this beautiful November weather bye bye